There is Cornwell. Cornwell Friday. What's up, John? Happy New Year, everybody. Happy New Year. Let's check it out. All right. Uh, looks like you got the new Milwaukee stack pack system. I'm joking, of course. Uh, those are my tote for a <laughs> special ordered item per day. That'd be one way of being able to sell it, though. All right. What we got going on here? Ooh. All right, this is this is the free scan tool that you were talking about, huh? <laughs> yeah. Mike's all about it, right, Mike? Hey. Free yeah, scan buddy. tool. Woo. Oh yeah. Comedian <laughs> <laughs> in every bunch. Uh, ooh, Cornwall air hammer. Let's check that out. Woo. Looks nice. Mm hmm. Let's see, what do we got going on here? Got a whole lot going on. Well, what? I don't know. I don't know, John. Truck looks kind of empty. Yeah. <laughs> I, I've had a couple of good days this week, so. Yeah. Right on. Let's see. I, I, of course, I've been I've been told that there's uh, uh, going to be 120 unicorns delivered. Huh. AKA screwdrivers from four months ago. Oh, yeah, but well, by then uh, the, everyone's already got screwdrivers in and you'll well, be stuck with 140. I'll sell them. <laughs> I bet. I'll toss them in for free with purchase of tool cart. No, 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 no. Well, maybe. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, maybe. Well, I caught you maybe. on that one. <laughs> maybe. Maybe. If the numbers come out right, maybe. Well, that's right, a little price adjustment, huh, Michael? Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, someone just got a new scan too. Oh, woo, look at it. Ah, yeah. If the screwdrivers come in, when they do, I'll throw a set of you bought that. Oh, I'm going to yeah. do one better. The I screwdrivers just came in. Here you go. <laughs> Take them with you. Done deal, baby. Give away my truck. Ah. I feel like he gets a complimentary hat, knife, and screwdriver. No, you're, you're pushing it now, Justin. <laughs> you're pushing it. Okay. Come on, man. Where are the socks at? Where's it at? <laughs> where are the socks at? Oh, yeah, where are the free I socks? Where are the free socks at? Huh? Snap on that free socks. Here we go. Here's some oversized socks right here for your hands. Some free socks. Here you go. Some hands. <laughs> Man, always a good time on the tool truck, I'm telling you. It's just, it's one of those things that I thoroughly enjoy, man. I, I love talking about tools. I love hanging out on the tool truck, just joking, cracking jokes, having a good time. But in all seriousness, uh, today I was able to lay down some information about the Alltel product because I've done my fair share of research on scan tools a while back. You guys know that. I research products before I buy them, depending on what it is that I'm looking for toolboxes, service carts. I had my fair share of going through those. I knew some things. I asked the right questions. I've been kind of doing this YouTube thing now for almost about eight or nine years. And, uh, you know, I had some information to share with a buddy of mine that I work with, Angel, who picked up the Altel scan tool today. And uh, I forget which one it was, a 608 or something like that. But he was asking me some questions about it. And one of the things we covered was warranty. You know, one of the things that I remembered most about Altel was with the subscription. You know, once you re-up the subscription, you got a new warranty with the scan tool. That there's also adapters that you can buy and add on to your kit. If you're working on different vehicles, they have Asian, European, and then they got the domestic adapters. There are some heavy duty ones, but I don't know that this scan tool can necessarily read heavy duty, though it did have a DPF regeneration feature on it. So, you know, makes me kind of wonder, could it possibly work on heavy duty application? Now, what he means by heavy duty, I don't know. If he's talking about Peterbilts and things like that, I don't know, okay? I would say probably not. I think that's its own separate scan tool. I think Snap-on even has its own separate scan tool specifically designed for the Peterbilts and the Mack trucks, okay? But covering domestics if he's referring to heavy duty being like diesel and things like that i think he's going to be satisfied overall with the product that he got using it for european asian and domestic i think he'll overall be satisfied with the product that he got 
He was asking about the lab scope. From what I've heard from other diagnosticians, to include those that are also on YouTube, the Altel uh, lab scope is not the best. If you were to get a lab scope, obviously Pico being at the top, and then I think Snap-on would be a close second, followed by everything else thereafter, right? Because who cares after first and second, in my opinion? Most people want the best. Other people want close to the best. So really depends on what it is that you're looking for out of a scan tool or a lab scope. One of those things that I remember from a long, long time ago was from Keith DeFazio when asked, you know, what kind of scan tool should I get? All of them, right? Because they all have a different feature. They all have a different benefit. Some work better with certain platforms and manufacturers than others. Some bi-directional features come on some that don't come on others. Sometimes the speed for live data is slower on some and faster on others, and then on and on and on. Some have guided component testing and things like that. So you really kind of be selective if you're purchasing your first scan tool, but then also at the same exact time, what are you going to use a scan tool primarily for? How in-depth or involved are you really going to get? Or how involved do you really want to get later down the road? Are you self-teaching? Is somebody walking you through it? Are you going to school? All these are different questions. Is it just for DIY? What are your uses for it? Do you just need it to see if, if it has a generic trouble code? And if it passed monitors, okay, you might be better off with, you know, a cheap hand one, right? A lot of people like that blue dongle that they plug into the DLC. I think my dad even uses it. So... At the end of the day, Angel's really happy. He thoroughly is excited about this scan tool. I can't wait to see what he thinks about it. Maybe he'll let us take a closer look at it later on down the road. But that's all I got for this video, guys. I got to get going. It's time to pick up children and go look for food for dinner because it's time for my turn to cook. So I don't know. Should I do a fast food night? It is Friday. Uh, is it a pizza night? Or... Does daddy get down on the grill? I think we might get down on the grill, to be honest. I think I might pick up some marshmallows too. Maybe do some s'more action. Maybe I go live. I don't know. Should be fun either way. Good TGIF. That's all I got. Cheers and deuces.